So somebody posted up a YouTube video of a little Pokemon Go hack where you can go ahead and hatch your eggs without ever leaving the bedroom. Watching the video, the person straps their smartphone to the blade of one of their ceiling fans and kind of just lets it ride for a little while. And apparently what they're saying is that it works. From the video they show, it looks like it's working. But I want to go ahead and kind of replicate that with proof to see whether or not this is simply just a myth or if it's actually true. So I went ahead and measured the blades on my fan. It's about almost 22 inches in length per blade. So I went ahead and at the very edge of the blade taped on my smartphone using electrical tape because the only tape I unfortunately have in the house. But if you're going to try and replicate this yourself, go ahead and try and use something that's very strong adhesive. Make sure you tape it down two to three times. I did it at the front of the phone, the back of the phone, and straight down the middle just to make sure it's nice and secure. Although I probably wouldn't recommend actually doing this even if it does end up working. Now as you can see I kind of have, you see the electrical tape, my phone taped down to the very edge of the fan blade. Hopefully that'll keep it fastened on there well enough otherwise uh, let's just hope that OtterBox really protects my phone like it's supposed to. Uh, let's see if we can see any real difference. So after reviewing the recordings, I was actually surprised to see that on all three speeds, this trick actually does work. So there's no myth behind it. It's confirmed. Uh, I would still say going out there, even just walking at a slow pace, would still be better when it comes to hatching eggs. But if you do not have that capability for whatever reason, or, or if like it's a Florida summer like it is here, and it's just unbearably hot, then this could be a method that you can implement to go ahead and try and hatch your eggs. So go ahead and let me know what you thought of this little myth busting video in the comments below. And if you have any other myths you'd like to see me try and see whether or not they are true or simply just a myth, go ahead and also let me know in the comments below. Almost forgot. Also be sure to check out my in-depth Pokemon Go trainer's guide that shows you some nice tips, tricks, and secrets such as how to start out with a Pikachu, how to earn Pokecoins and other items for free without cheating or hacking, and also how to level up rather quickly. At level 5, you are sorted into Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, or Gryffindor. Wait a minute, that doesn't sound right. No, I'm sorry. You're put into Team Instinct, Mystic, or Valor. 